Dan Perry here with another C++ tutorial for Dan on Tech. In this video we'll continue looking at math functions and we're going to look at the uh, e to the x uh, function or the e to the exponent function. With it what we're doing is raising that magic number e or raising a to a value x. So the function itself is exp for exponent of whatever our variable say x is. <clears throat> so to use it I've created a couple of uh, variables x and y and we're just going to output the results to a c out <clears throat> where we're going to say that the uh, exponent of x is equal to hit the right key again and we'll you just use the exp and let's just use x as our variable as we said and go ahead and put it on a new line and we'll also do that with y where y is 1 and remember and I I'm just going to put a 1 there, which is our value of y in this case. And if you remember, any re number raised to the first power is itself. So when we run this, what we end up getting is that e to the x of... 3.2 where x was 3.2 is 24.5 something and e to the first power is 2.71828 which is the value e. e is one of, one of those magic numbers and so it occurs a lot in math and if you go back to when we did the logarithm the natural log uh, <coughs> If I were to do a log of the exponent of x, basically we're reversing that operation. So if I were to do the log, and remember we can nest functions, of the exponent of x we should end up back with x so let's run that one just to see how that result gives us and we come up with the 3.2 and again our x value is 3.2 so the e to the x function is essentially the inverse of that natural logarithm we've looked at uh, in another video. Well, thank you for watching this Dan on Tech video. Please subscribe to this playlist so you don't miss future videos. Please check out and subscribe to our other Dan on Tech channel playlists.